Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we are going to see what functions in Omni Studio are and how we can use them to transform our data. We would also explore a few very basic functions and then I would introduce you to the concept of custom functions. So let's dive right into it. Omni Studio provides a way to transform our data using formulas where we can use operators and functions to perform calculations. After the calculation is done, we can map the output of this formula to a JSON node and then use it further in the process. We can find the formulas tab in Data Raptor Extract, Data Raptor Transform and Data Raptor Load. Please note that the formulas tab is not available in Data Raptor Turbo Extract. Let's see how it works by the help of a demo. In the demo, we are going to use a data raptor transform, which is going to take a list of number as input and then do some calculation using functions and finally map the result to a node named total. Let's create a new data raptor. Let's name it as demo8. The interface type is going to be transform and the input type and output type is going to be JSON. Click on save. I have created an input JSON which I am going to paste over here. Let's go to the formulas tab and click add formula. We have a function called sum. Let's use the same function. And for the parameter, we need to pass our list. Let's give this formula result path a name which is going to be result. At this point of time, I would like to show you the chronology that the JSON processing is going to follow. This is our data raptor transform. And somewhere here is our formulas. Formula is going to get the request or input JSON and work on the data nodes that are being received in the input JSON. The output of this formula is again going to be considered as a JSON input and then we'll have to map the input fields to the output fields what we are doing right now. And finally, after the transform is completed, you are going to get a response which is going to be our output JSON. Let's move to transforms and map the input JSON path with the output JSON path. Please keep in mind that if you don't map the input to the output, you won't be able to see any result in the preview section. Let me show you how. Let's execute it once. You see, the response is blank. Let's map the input and outputs. We will map the result input JSON path with total. Let's go ahead and see if it's working or not. As you can see, the sum is being shown, which is 12. 
In a similar manner, we can also use another function which is average. Let's see how it works. We will simply remove sum and add average which is AVG. Let's try to review the result. Let's change the output JSON path first and change it to average. And the average has been calculated as 4, which is right. Apart from the simple functions like sum and average that we have seen, OmniStudio formulas provide the capability to call an Apex class and method to handle more complex computational needs. While calling this function, we need to provide three arguments. First argument is going to be the class name. Second is the method. And third input is going to be the input data. In order to invoke and execute a custom function defined in an Apex class, we need our class to implement callable interface. In the upcoming videos, we would explore the callable interface so that we can use this mighty function in Omni Studio. Until then, thanks for watching the video and see you next time.